Thanks to recent developments, pun intended, R&B singer Akon has become one of the more interesting real estate entrepreneurs on the planet. However, it has relatively little to do with the Atlanta homes he's continually trying to move off of, even as nice as they are. No, Akon's real splash has come with his decision to build an entire housing market by his own damn self for millions of people by creating a real-life Wakanda city in his home country of Senegal in Africa. And today, we're gonna take a look at all of Akon's real estate. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Akon is a singer, songwriter, producer, and more who rose to fame in 2004 with the release of Locked Up, followed by the single Lonely. At the time of this recording, he has an estimated net worth of $80 million, and it's said he's using that to build his own housing market in Africa. So two or three years from now, if you just so happen to be visiting that area of the world, you could find yourself staying at an Akon sponsored resort and booking time at a five star Akon spa while paying for the whole thing with your very own Acoin currency. Hey guys, it's Kara the Vampire Slayer back with another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment. This one looking at the homes and plans of Akon. Be sure to like, subscribe, and follow me over on Instagram to chat. And now let's get into this video. Akon started off his career by getting everyone to smack that, but if things wind up going to the way he wants them to in the future, that'll be one of the last things people think of when they hear the name Akon 30 years from now. Before we get into the biggest project of his life, Akon City, let's take a look at his earliest flirtations with the real estate game, his two homes located in the great state of Georgia. First up is a massively sprawling complex that was built in 1990 and is located at the tail end of a cul-de-sac in a gated community known as Sandy Springs. This 14,994 square foot mansion sits on 13.3 acres of land and features six bedrooms, six full bathrooms, as well as two half baths. It also comes with a little bit of, well, everything. Not only are the interiors lofty and bright, they offer a sleek white on white motif, something that we're definitely going to be seeing again before this story is through. Beyond the front door of the home is a double height foyer with a spectacular spiral staircase. Meanwhile, glass walls surround the primary living spaces, allowing for all that ample sunlight to filter in. There is also a large living room alongside a dining room with a built-in bar and of course a spacious chef's kitchen. If you ever find yourself staying inside one of the home's two guest houses, I mean, I have no idea why you would, that's why I said if. So if you're ever visiting, you can also check out the endless entertainment options, like either one of the indoor or outdoor pools. Finally, if you just happen to be stopping by and suddenly find yourself in dire need of filling up your gas tank before you go, don't worry, Akon's got you covered with the single weirdest purchase he said that he's ever made. That's right, you can fill up your tank at Akon's very own Chevron branded gas pump. Once you're done with all that, why not spend some time on the indoor basketball slash tennis court? I'm sure Akon won't mind. Odds are he won't even be here anyways, because only three months after purchasing this place for $2.6 million, he turned right around and listed it again. Why? Well, probably because this house is definitely something of a fixer upper. But still, what a fixer upper, am I right? Next up is Akon's home located in Alpharetta, Georgia. It was only about a year after purchasing his first Atlanta home that Akon scooped up this bad boy for $1.65 million. Part of the Atlanta National Golf Club, this mansion is situated on 4.6 acres of land and if you thought Akon's last home had a lot of white in it, well this one is all white everything. In fact, it kind of resembles something out of Frozen, no? All six bedrooms, 11 bathrooms, and even the staggering nine car garage feature the same icy white motif. So you'll have to really be a fan of white, not to mention one of the cleanest people on planet Earth to get the most out of living here. In terms of what the home features, well, it's got a spectacular exterior with a lagoon pool and resort-like vibes emanating from the surrounding patio furniture that clearly spared no expense. This includes some gorgeous cabanas. Meanwhile, on the inside, he's got a killer living room with a baby grand piano and complimentary furniture with a silver finish. 
There's also an absolutely jaw-dropping dining room that looks like it's fit for a king, especially with that gigantic chandelier hanging just above the table. Of course, no self-respecting recording artist would be without their own in-home studio, and you can bet that Akon comes with all the necessary bells and whistles. Despite the fact that this residence has clearly been custom made for Akon, he still had this home on the market for quite some time, asking for $7 million to complete the sale. All right, now that we have an idea of where Akon stays when he's stateside, let's take a look at the thousands of homes he's looking to build for others in his home nation of Senegal. These days, Akon is spending most of his time moving forward with his plans to create a $6 billion smart city in the country of Senegal. Akon City is the place will one day be known as being hyped as a real life Wakanda, a technological paradise that construction will begin on in the very near future. This 2,000 acre metropolis was first hyped by Akon back in 2018 and is expected to run on clean energy, no doubt supplied by Akon's other business venture, Akon Lighting Africa. As you can see in these images, Akon City is going to sport a futuristic aesthetic that will match all of the cutting edge technology Akon is pumping into the place. Designed by Bakri and Associates Development Consultants, this city is characterized by its gleaming skyscrapers that have an almost surreal feel. You know, kind of like a Ridley Scott film mixed with a neck massager, if you know what I mean. Akon has promised the city will feature shopping malls, schools, music and film recording studios, eco-friendly tourist resorts, a sports stadium, a casino, open markets, restaurants, high-rise condos, and its very own currency, Acoin. Yes, that's exactly what it sounds like, a cryptocurrency developed by Akon. Man, he's really thought of everything for this place, hasn't he? As I mentioned a moment or two ago, Akon City will be located in Akon's home country of Senegal, where he spent much of his childhood before moving to the States at the age of 11. It's Akon's hope that with this new city, he's going to stimulate the local economy and create much needed jobs for his people. He also hopes that it will prove to be a place where black Americans can move to if facing racial injustice in America. So how is Akon affording all of this? Sure, his $80 million net worth is mightily impressive, but it's hardly a drop in the bucket for a task this big. To make sure his dream becomes a reality, Akon has teamed with Julian Mwale, a Kenyan technology entrepreneur, who has reportedly invested $4 billion into this project. That still leaves Akon a few billion short of the necessary $6 billion he's projecting, but the plan is for construction to get underway soon. As for right now, the only thing located in Akon City is this ceremonial rock. So now we've taken a look at Akon's homes in Georgia over the years and his plans for his Akon City in Africa. Akon has said that if this endeavor becomes a success, then he plans on franchising the concept to other countries in Africa. What do you guys think? Is there any chance we could all get to visit Akon City sometime in the next five years? And let me know your thoughts on Akon's Georgia homes as well, or what your favorite aspects were. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram to chat, and I will see you all next time. Bye.